I'm Dr. Ruby. Welcome to the Veggie Chest, where healthy food is easy and delicious. And today we're making one of my favorites. I always say that because I only make my favorite foods. So we're making spaghetti squash with a marinara sauce. And the difference about this one is it's all raw. I've been really liking to incorporate lots more raw food in my diet. So you'll see a lot of raw recipes. This is the spaghetti squash. You could also use this recipe um, very much the same as you would cooked. The only difference is you would go ahead and bake this and then scrape out the insides, uh, similar to what I'm gonna do right now. So the first thing you wanna do is just get all the guts out of the squash. Once you get all the seeds and things out, you just put it aside just like that. And then you can just start scraping it like you would a cooked spaghetti squash and you get nice long pieces. These will be a little shorter pieces because this is not cooked. So then you just start scraping it out just like that. Now you could use a mandolin like I did and just cut it into large slices and um, use your julienne blade on a thin setting and then it comes out just like this and it's very easy to do um, when you have a mandolin. So once we have it nice and grated, we wanna just give it a little marinade with some crushed garlic. We put our crushed garlic in, about two cloves, and then a little bit of olive oil. And then you mix that in and just set it aside while you make your sauce. So now on to our sauce. First, we're going to add about two to three um, Roma tomatoes, depending on how much sauce you're making. Um, and you can use uh, sun-dried tomatoes. You need sun-dried tomatoes, but you can either use the sun-dried tomatoes that are packed in olive oil, or you can use um, the dry ones. If you're going to use the dried ones that are not packed, you want to rehydrate them in some warm water first. I'm using the olive oil ones because I like they, they also have flavored with rosemary. So it adds a lot of good flavor um, to the sauce. And you really don't need much additional olive oil because it already has it there. Now just for a little bit of sweetness, we're gonna add some dates. We just take the pit out and add a little date there. And we're gonna add our seasoning, some fresh oregano, some basil, Um, a little sea salt, just a pinch of cayenne, depending on how spicy you like things. I like spice, um, two cloves of garlic, and a shallot. And you can always, I like to start slow because you can always add more onion and more flavor, but you can't take it out. So we'll put that in and see how it goes and then taste it. Then a little bit of nutritional yeast. This is an inactive yeast that adds a lot of flavor and makes things a little uh, creamy and a little bit of a cheesy flavor. So we're just gonna put that together and blend. All right, so now we're all done with the blending. And we are just going to take this sauce and pour it right over our spaghetti squash. Now, some people like to heat up the spaghetti squash just a little bit, even um, if it's raw, which is fine. It gives it a nice, um, nice warm texture to it. And then you just mix this all together, um, just like that. It smells delicious. You add a little more spaghetti squash so you have enough there and, and you're done. So there you have it, a delicious spaghetti squash with marinara sauce, all raw, full of delicious enzymes, life, and energy. So just try your own variation, whether you do cooked or raw, but give it a try. And I hope you enjoy it like I'm about to. So thank you for joining me on this episode of The Veggie Chest, where healthy food is easy and delicious. <laughs>